Hey everybody, my name is Jay, and I've got some news I need to relay. <laughs> hey everyone, so we're starting on a high note, but unfortunately there is some bad news, and I'll just get this out of the way. So the official Sonic Twitter page has just tweeted saying, Hi everyone, we know delays are way past not cool, but with the world in its current state and to keep our team safe, we need to wait to show you our South by Southwest content until things have settled. Thanks for your patience, and we'll let you know as soon as we have a date to share. So, unfortunately, that is bad news. The South by Southwest content was already delayed. It's been pushed even further back. But it's also understandable. Like, it's, it's hard to share gaming news when there's so many other bigger things going on in the world right now. However, this is a Sonic News update, and you know what that means? It means I've got to play through Emerald Coast every time. It's, it's a tradition now, I've just got to. But, yeah, I mean, I understand this completely. It sucks, because I, I wanted to learn more about Sonic News. It's been a long time since the last actual Sonic game. I mean, Sonic Forces was the last 3D game, and that was 2017 now, three years ago. Uh, we have had Team Sonic Racing since then, but it's not the same. And it was kind of weird watching the Sonic movie and having the only game advertised beforehand being Team Sonic Racing. Because that's, it's a spin-off. You know, it's still good, but it's not the game that I wanted out of, uh, you know, as the big game of the year. So hopefully they do have a bigger game coming down the line, but unfortunately we have to wait a bit until we can actually see it. But yeah, it's reasonable. It happens when it happens. I mean, the game was going to be likely delayed anyway because of the circumstances going around the world, so... Knowing about it now doesn't make much of a difference in the grand scheme of things. But, I mean, that, that, that's a good mindset to have, I think. Like, it's, it's cool to be disappointed, um, but remember, human beings are making this game. And we've got to respect that. So last time, I think we got only, like, a two-minute time, which isn't bad, but we can beat that. Although I have been a little bit slow at the start, that we missed a skip um, over by the... Um... The big thing, you know, <laughs> before the whale. <laughs> we also could have got a skip there, but I chose not to for some reason. I hesitated. Oh, can we make this? Uh, just about. Just about. And you know what? I think there was a skip back there too that we just completely missed. Oh, well. But yeah, I mean, I don't even know what kind of game I... Oh, God! God, Sonic, no! Are you okay? Yeah, I don't even know what kind of game I want, to be honest. Ooh. Oh god, no! Okay, we're alive. We're alive. What happened there? I mean, I think the... You can tell I'm an adventure fan, so I really like an adventure game in the style of the Crash and Spyro remasters um, of Adventure 1 and Adventure 2. But, I don't know. I'm okay with whatever they do and whenever they choose to show it, but right now just isn't really the right time. So yeah, unfortunate state for the world right now, we can't get that much game news because they can't really, well because developers can't really commit to a certain date, so it's unfortunate but it is the way it is. So let us know what you guys think about the delay down below and what you're expecting from South by Southwest when it eventually happens. Thanks for watching and of course be sure to subscribe to Game Explain for a lot more on Sonic and other things gaming too. Until next time, bye!